local neighborhood is outraged tonight over how police enforced a nuisance law. And only 19 Action News was rolling when it happened. Ed Gallick is here to show you what happened. Well, this video made us ask, isn't there a better way? Watch what police did cracking down on some kids playing basketball in the street. A portable basketball hoop hauled away as evidence, dragged away. That hoop in front of a house on Mayview, Cleveland's near west side. Sherry Fiorelli bought the hoop for neighbor kids. They help her out. But in Cleveland, you can't play ball in the street. And that led to this and Sherry getting a ticket. Here, cell phone video. People are complaining that they're playing ball in the street. There's no warning. There's nothing, There's nothing I can do. Plenty of parks around here. If they want to play basketball, their parents can take them to a rec center or to a park with a hoop. There's no leeway. It's a must. He had a bad temper. I just felt sad. The kids stunned. Sherry, too. And an officer grew impatient. Need to see your driver's license again. If not, I have to arrest you for refusing to comply. But did it have to go like this? We called the chief's office. By email, a spokesperson said the kids had been warned many times. Sherry got a ticket since she, quote, declared herself the owner of the hoop. One driver did tell us the hoop has been a problem, but Sherry fighting her ticket. I'm not living like that. I pay my taxes. I'm, I am ashamed. I'm ashamed of what that man did, the example he set for these kids. Meantime, we saw another hoop like that still standing two blocks away, actually in the street near a stop sign. Sherry says she paid 50 bucks for that hoop, now facing a fine and court fees of 182 bucks. Reporting live at Gallic, 19 Action News.